assalamu alaikum my dear class 4 how are you all i hope everyone of you is good so class 4 this is your second reunion lecture of english and this this will be also from your monthly test uh, that uh, from the syllabus of your monthly test and in it we are going to revise uh, your broadway workbook concept uh, and for, uh, this will be, this will be from the chapter number 5 and which is who which is the billy bear stumpy tail okay come to it okay okay broad the workbook chapter number 5 billy bear stumpy tail learn words different ways of eating okay we are going to revise learn words in which uh, there is there is discussed about the ways of eating okay learn words the words on the next page describes different ways of eating okay on the next page there are some different ways of eating khane ke mukhtalif tareeke bataye gaye hain match them with the correct meanings in column b hame unhe column b mein jo correct unka meaning hai uske sath match karna hai by drawing lines use a dictionary if you're not sure of the meaning aur hum dictionary ka istemal kar sakte hain agar hum uska meaning ke bare mein sure nahi hai but of course uh, you you won't do this in the monthly test okay then write the name of a food item that you chew lick etc aur phir aapne and you have to give the example of that meaning too okay of that word too is a lick hame koi word diya so we have to uh, match with the meaning of the lick and we have to write one example of the lick or chew okay on the blank lines the first one has been done for you our first shown in a word jo aapke liye kiya gaya hai for your help Okay, now come to that page. Okay, it's on the page number. Uh, it's uh, it's from your Broadview workbook, and it's the chapter number five, and it's the page number forty. Okay. So the first word in the column is chew. What is the meaning of chew? Chew means chabana. Okay, and they have match. As you can see, they have match in the column B, uh, with the second sentence to bite food many times to make it softer and easier to swallow. Chew का मतलब उन्होंने इससे किया है to bite आपके food को इतना bite करना कि उसको आप नरम कर दें और so it will be easier to swallow ताकि वो निगलने में आसान आपको आसानी हो इतना chew करना चबाना so what will you write an example for chew what do you chew you chew uh, so there are many foods what do you chew so they have given the example in front of it that meat a meat ko bhi chew karte hain so they have given the example in the blank okay next one is lick hmm so where you will match it uh we have to see it number one is to number one is Okay, this is to eat something steadily, noisily. Hmm, lick क्या होते हैं? चाटना. तो lick में हम steadily, noisily, आवाज आवाज लगाते हैं. आवाज आती है खाने की. Particularly when you enjoy the food you're eating. No, this is not right. Oh, this one is right. Maybe to eat something by by moving your tongue over it. ऐसी किसी चीज़ को खाना. This आप by moving your tongue. आप इस पे ज़ुबान को आप move कर रहे हैं. Yes, we lick by we lick like this. So this is the right meaning of lick. So we will match lick by this sentence. Okay. So what will be the example of lick? Lick की क्या example हो सकती है? Yes, ice cream and whatever. you like whatever we have done in the class ice cream and what else uh, you uh, you have in your mind you can write okay next one is munch okay what is munch hmm what is munch uh, okay we will see slowly by slowly first is to make food or drink move down your throat is it hmm next is to eat something in very small bites no Okay, first is to eat something steadily and noisily, particularly when you enjoy the food. ऐसे किसी चीज़ को जल्दी uh, to eat something steadily and noisily. आराम आराम से किसी चीज़ को खाना और आवाज़ निकालना और mostly you do this when you enjoy the food you are eating means uh, you do this when when you are eating a favorite food. आप mostly आवाज़ तब निकालते हैं आराम आराम से मज़े लेके उस चीज़ को खाते हैं when you enjoy that food when this is your when that is your favorite food. Yes, yeah, so munching. मंच का मतलब होता है आवाज़ निकाल के जो आप खाते हैं और आराम आराम से खाते हैं सो दैर इज मंचिंग वैन समबडी मेक नॉइस एंड समबडी ईट स्लोली देन यू कैन सी दैट ही इज मंचिंग इज फूड राइट सो विल मैच मंच विद द फर्स्ट इंटेंस ओके 
and we will write the example here what we will write what is the example of munch um, uh, you can write any favorite food of yours and it will be correct okay the next one is nibble which we have done uh, which we have uh, studied also in the chapter nibble okay nibble means as you already remember that to eat in very small bites so is it uh, uh, written here any B uh, bites meaning yes to eat something in very small bites we will match nibble with this to eat something in very small bites okay so what will be the example kaun si aisi cheeze jo chote chote tukde kar mein khate hain small bite chote chote bites leke khate hain it can be anything biscuits or anything jo aap biscuit chips there are so many things of food that you can write so you have to think and you have to write okay next one is swallow okay swallow means nigalna so there is uh, one meaning left to make food to make food or drink down your throat khane peene khane ki cheez ko ya peene ki cheez ko apne aap jab nigalte hain jab niche leke jate hain apne gale se to wo kya hota hai nigalna swallow karna okay so what uh, you can write any food or any drink you can write cola sprite any food any drink um, you can write in drink you can write in drink that um, you can write in drink anything um water coke any juice then you can write any food which you swallow we swallow all the foods hum har food ko it's obvious that we swallow hum har food ko nigalte hain so you can write any food that you like so that's about it we have discussed uh, some of the concept from the course book and some from the workbook so good luck class for do well in your monthly test best of luck thank you